Hello everyone, Major Frenchy from aimingabox.com. Today we're seeing Future Pinball, which is a free virtual pinball software. To download the uh, software, you're just going to go to futurepinball.com and click on the download button found on the front page and you will download that on your computer and then we're going to install it once it's downloaded. One thing I forgot to mention, before you launch the program, right click on the future pinball.exe file and you're going to go check on the property and change it to run as administrator. Um, if you don't do that, you may see that the game will launch but you won't be able to get a ball or whatnot. You'll, you'll have no sound, so you got to run this as admin. In preference, you're going to click the editor on the top and remove the checkbox that says load image into editor. Now preference, and we're going to go to uh, game keys. Now this is where you set up the uh, buttons to work in the game. Um, if you see on the top right, there's a little uh, box. Click enable, and now here you're going to be able to select a button for your left flipper, right flipper, and all the different function within the game. In control panel, you're going to click on devices and printers, and then you're going to see that you have your gaming controller will, will display uh, as a USB joystick. Right click, select the config, and just select your USB joystick again or controller. And, and a screen will appear, and here is going to be uh, the buttons. When you press a button, it'll map the number. So you see it here is one. And um, so and so on. So mark them down, and then once you go back in the software, uh, it will ask you, for example, left flipper, and then just put the number matching to your left flipper. It's that easy. And the last option in preference is the video. In here, uh, you will select the different screens that are for your play field or your back box. If you use a second monitor, click that use second monitor box and then you're gonna use the drop down to the display and pick the appropriate uh, resolution for your device. Now you might want to run that full screen and um, also what you might want to use is the vertical sync uh, and if you have a, an issue where your back box does not play, just click with the display monitor uh, drop down and change it to a 2 uh, or just play around because the ID that is displayed in Windows is different than the ID in Future Pinball. Now that the game is installed, we need to download some games. I love to visit uh, PinSimDB. It's a really good site where the uh, tables, the description is, is phenomenal and the server is really quick. So browse through the different tables here and pick the one you want to download and we're going to show you what to put in what folder once the download is complete.
Once the game is downloaded, you're going to right click and then we're going to click cut. We're going to go in the pinball folder where the download FP folder is and we're going to paste that game right in here. We're going to right click and extract the files. Now future pinball sometimes has different files than uh, now and this one only has the table um, but sometimes you'll have music or, or you'll have different libraries and we're going to show you that in the next table. But this one you can just copy that FP file and then we're just going to paste it in the future pinball and we're going to put it in the table folder. Buster, you're up. Now here you can just press F1, F2, F3 to change the different views of the table. Fun house. <laughs> hey, Buster, you're up. <laughs> hey, Buster, you're up. You can have it back. Ow. So now we're going to install Back to the Future. Uh, this is the ultimate 3.0 mod that's found on the website. And we're just going to install that on our computer. Okay, now that we have the uh, the file downloaded, uh, we're just going to copy it into the uh, download FP folder. We're going to extract the files, and you'll notice that in this folder, there's going to be more files than the other one. We got the table, and you see the little uh, white or the orange icon. These are libraries, like they're the sound used in the table. So what you're going to do? is you're going to go to the future pinball folder and you see on there's a folder called libraries open that up and take the three folders that are libraries and just drag them over and we are gonna just take the uh, the table and then we're just gonna take it and copy it into the uh, the folder. Now you see there is also an XML file. If you see an XML file with the table, this is uh, most likely the uh, physics and um, I, I, I highly recommend that you actually put it in the same folder as the table. We're going to launch the table. 
and see how cool that table looks. Welcome to the Cafe 80s, where it's always morning in America, even in the afternoon to noon. <laughs> Back to the future! I'm from the future. I came here in a time machine. Now I need your help to get back to the year 1985. Are you telling me you built a time machine out of a DeLorean? Now the physics is really, really cool in this game. Uh, it's well done. Now, not every game have a good physics. Now, what you can do is take that XML, if you like the physics of one particular table, you can take that XML file, and what you do is you just rename it uh, to whatever other table you want to use it for. You're just going to name it the same uh, name as your table. So just a quick trick here. And uh, also, we, what we're going to do in a future episode, we're going to show you how to install BAM. And uh, it's, uh, BAM stands for Better Arcade Mode. It's a plug-in, pretty much, for Future Pinball, where it turns this into an arcade. Uh, so it's like full screen. It's easy to manage the back glass. You can set settings that will affect every table and just not one. So it's a great add-on. Uh, you can also have like a virtual uh, reality helmet, uh, like an uh, Oculus Rift or something like that, where you can play some 3D uh, types of tables. We've never tried that, maybe eventually we will. Uh, we just don't own uh, like a 3D visor. So, But uh, people say it's pretty cool. So Future Pinball is a great game, guys. Uh, just install it. There are tons of tables. And uh, yeah, we're going to see you probably in the next video and uh, eventually look for BAM, and uh, we're gonna talk a little more about this setup. Thanks for watching, folks.